Oh, 
to another episode of your favorite weekend program, Dab, the Weekend Worship with Hermanos Coral, coming to you live from the studios of Divine Media HD. My name is Osai Nyaku Emmanuel, Public Relations Director of the Hermanos Coral. You can always call me the one whom Jesus loves. I delight in bringing you relevant inspiration. I don't do that alone. I do that with my beautiful co-host, Amanda Ifwa Abroka. And before Amanda says anything, you know <laughs> how the situation is, you know how the, 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 the thing will go. We are going to take a season song, season two song, season song Unyame Akasa by James Barrick Ama, also known as Ebefa. Let's enjoy this. We will be right back. Oh, no. 
song titled Ebefa by James Farikama with barely 33 days to Christmas we just have to give glory and praise and thanks adoration and honor to whom it is due our God our maker our protector our defender our healer our peace our banner our provision throughout this year our theme for today is give glory to God give glory to God and our and our scripture is from Luke chapter 2. We are reading from verse 14. Luke chapter 2, verse 14. It says that glory to God in the highest and on earth peace to men on whom his favor rests. Yeah, that's powerful. Um, come to think of it, uh, the, 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 the scripture is in two parts, mm -hmm. but we are focusing on the very first part. Right. Uh, but we all know the circumstance surrounding this very scripture. Mm -hmm. It's about the angel visiting mm -hmm. um, the earth and announcing the birth of Jesus. Mm -hmm. uh, people will say, why are you talking about this now? Mm -hmm. We are talking about giving glory to God, God. part. And rightly so, 33 days to Christmas, mm -hmm. and this is the period that we can hmm. um, kickstart it. Yes. And I'm so excited this message came to us because look, there is so much tension in the atmosphere, so much, so much tension. Um, I think yesterday, some people were going to do campaign, they are bars <laughs> over 10, six people died, others are in critical injury. There is so much tension, <sighs> okay. But this is a time that we need to focus on the glory of God also, because we should give um, glory to God um, in all things. We should also give thanks to God in all things. In all things. You see, someone will say that, ah, so are you saying that when, quote unquote, bad things happen to us, mm -hmm. we should give thanks? We are not giving thanks because of the bad things that have happened mm -hmm. to us, but we are giving thanks that in those bad things, still God good. will still show himself strong. So that is why we are giving glory to God like scripture says I love the scripture first Corinthians chapter 10 verse 31 and you see there is a there is a, a particular story behind uh, me discovering that scripture right okay so I was in secondary school I was a choir chaplain mm -hmm. okay and uh, you know secondary school there was this um, rule that says choristers are not supposed to dance, dance at, at entertainment, entertainment. <laughs> and there was this generation of choristers our genius they, they stood up and says show us the choir constitution that <laughs> says that <laughs> we shouldn't, we shouldn't that that mean? that's one two mm -hmm. we have paid for entertainment <laughs> <laughs> so you have to refund that oh. money to us we're like so we had a crisis meeting myself uh, the former um head of it prince yes. prince was the choir master so prince was my mate in secondary school <laughs> prince was the choir master yeah. and a couple of others we had a meeting so are we now going to draw a constitution <laughs> And it would the constitution take retrospective mm -hmm. um, effect, effect or yeah. what? Because the guys are saying they want to dance they at entertainment. Want to dance. You know, there were other things you could do at entertainment, right. but it's the jams aspect. Mm -hmm. So I was a choir chaplain. Then at the meeting, 
I think I was flipping through my new, uh, no, this Good News Bible, you know, right. Gideon's Bible, the, the small pocket. The small I was flip, just flipping through and I saw First Corinthians 10.31. Therefore, whether you eat or drink or whatever you do, do it all to the glory of God. The moment I saw it, the thing hit me like thunderbolt, and I said, "Guys, we have the constitution for the choir." I said, "Where is it?" I said, "This is the scripture." I said, "How do you mean?" I explain it. I said, "Fine, it's okay, but when we meet them at the meeting, uh, general meeting, you be the one to talk." I said, "That's fine." <laughs> so when we said the constitution, it's time for the constitution. Yeah. I just went to the chalkboard and I wrote constitution of the choir. I wrote First Corinthians chapter ten, verse thirty-one. Therefore, whether you eat or drink or whatever you do, do it all to, to the, the glory, glory of, God. of God. So if it's time for judgment. And they are playing mm-hmm. songs that you know these songs are not quote unquote okay. To the glory of God. And you want to go and dance and you can do it to the glory of God. <laughs> go and do it. <laughs> Guess what happened? That's blackmail. <laughs> <laughs> so that was a condition. We had a, a choir strength of 140. The next we had ours, I think 30 people attended. <laughs> They have left the class the glory of God. <laughs> because, you see, they didn't dance at the event. No. But there were other things they were doing in their life that uh, that thing covers. Mm-hmm. Because doing everything to the glory of God mm-hmm. means that, look, um, there is no chance for you to just um, um, say that, no, you live carelessly. Mm-hmm. Because people are watching. As Christians, we, are, we, we may be the only Bible people will read. Right. So that scripture um, um, speaks a lot to me. Anytime yes. I read it, I remember that. <laughs> you remember the story. But we were able to recruit them back. Uh, back. They came back. They all yeah. came back. It was just a normal yeah. uh, um, <laughs> some, something, a yeah, youthful uh, exuberance. Yeah. Even though we were youth, it was youthful exuberance. <laughs> you know? So yeah. that is what we are discussing today, giving glory mm-hmm. to God. We'll talk about what the glory of God is. Uh, Moses experienced the glory of God. And um, there is a scripture that, that, that um, attests to that. We, we will have a dichotomy between that glory and then the glory we have in Christ Jesus. Right. So for the first song, Amanda, what do we have? Well, for the first song, we have Blessed Be the Man from Joseph and His Brethren. Brethren okay. And we are going to take that right away. You can go to our social media platforms on YouTube and on Facebook and share with us what it means for you to experience the glory of God and how you are thanking God for the remaining 33 days we mm. have to the 25th of December that we celebrate Christmas. Please enjoy this worship. We'll be right back. Blessed be the man, blessed be the man, blessed be the man, to well unchained, to well unchained. Blessed be the man, to well unchained. 
Welcome back to the studios of Divine Media HD. If you just joined us, you're just in time. This is the weekend worship with the Harmonious Crow. Our theme for today is Give Glory to God. I hope the Lord has done so much for you this year or even the years past and he's worthy of your praise and your worship and your thanks that is what we are trying to discuss with you of course in the studio today head over to our youtube or facebook platform and tell us how you're giving glory to god for how far he has brought you and your family your loved ones in all circumstances throughout this year tell us what he has done for you let us join our hearts with you to give praise and thanks to god Matthew chapter 5 verse 16 and I'm reading from the ESV and it says in the same way let your light shine before others so that they may see your good works and give glory to your father Amen. who is in heaven mm -hmm. and this is uh, what I call the network marketing principle of <laughs> giving glory to God right so it is not about only you giving glory to God um, through what you do but through what you do, others will see your good works and also give glory to God. Mm. Okay, God is big, God is great, God is omnipresent, He's omniscient, He's everlasting. Okay, but people need to see it, and the only way people will see it is through you. Right. You are the vessel, I'm the vessel. It is we letting this light that we have received from God through Jesus shining through us so that people may see our good works and then they will give glory to God. So, so like, it, is the, it is the other way around also. Yes. If they, don't, if they see bad works, yeah. they will you know, not yes. give glory so to So peop mm -hmm. people are not of faith because of what they see what they the see. people of faith do. Okay. Yes. So it is, it is, it is, um, it is an interesting thing. Yes. Not just we focusing on giving glory to God yes. through our good works mm -hmm. alone, but noting that people are also watching what you are doing. Right. We've said this before. It doesn't matter where you are. People are, people are watching. Whatever you do, people are watching. So we need to let this light that we have received from God shine before others. No one will light um, a, a lamp and put and it under, a under a bushel, under a table. You have to place it up high. So for us at Harmonious Coral, we believe the gifting that we have, the platforms that we have, that is what we will use to give glory right. to God. And that's why if you see us doing things, people think we are extravagant. But um, what I want to say is that God was extravagant enough to give us his best. Yes, he was extra. We serve an extravagant God. Okay. The, the, the story of the prodigal son could still pass as the story of the prodigal father. Prodigal is, 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 is not um, negative in its sense, right. okay? It means extravagant, though blowing it big, mm -hmm. yeah. So that is the father showing love to the son, unconditional love, big love to the father. So if we have received this from God, then we can only give glory to God. One thing that um, mom, our mother, Reverend Dr. Joyce Ayi, told me some days back, we were going for a, a program and I was late. Mm. And it was a red church. And I was very unlucky. When I got to the address, <laughs> I just met her at the address. And he was like, Amanda, you're late. So, mommy, please, I'm sorry. I said, don't give me excuses. You serve an excellent God. So whatever you do must be excellent. Mm. That thing has stuck with me yeah. through throughout the, the time. And yeah. as you rightly said, at Harmonious Choral, one of the one of the basic foundations that we dwell on is that w we serve an excellent God. Mm. We portray um, a certain quality of God, yeah. so we shouldn't give people the chance to say yeah. um, or mm -hmm. sort of something like that. And then on the back of us being an example for people to see, it doesn't give people. It shouldn't give people the room to criticize every move that a Christian makes. Yeah. For instance, yesterday there was a discussion on one of the platforms. It was concerning reverend ministers. Okay. And they were saying that, um, do pastors sin? <laughs> <laughs> and if you realize your pastor has sin, will it break your heart? Or will, mm. you, will it change your perception that you have about your pastors? Because mm. for pastors, we expect them to be... Santimonious. Like hundred yeah. percent, and we put so much pressure on them to live a certain kind of life. Mm. So sometimes you even find your Christian brothers living a certain kind of life outside, mm. and then when they go inside, they are different people. Yeah. Because if they don't give you the show that you are looking for, you say, "Hey, 
any way we normally say only your Christians. No? Yeah. So, you see. so in as much as we are looking at each other um, um, on this journey of, mm. of Christianity, we shouldn't be too quick to judge people. Okay. You understand? Yeah. Certain people are standing on slippery grounds mm. where they are standing. <clears throat> The way Emmanuel will handle the situation, and I, because I am not there, I'm criticizing him. Yeah. When I am put in that same situation, situation. I'll do worse things. Yeah. The goal is not to put pressure on each other. The mm. goal is to guide ourselves mm. because it is a journey that we are working on together. The yeah. goal is to make it to heaven. Yeah. So hold my hand. Let me hold it virtually though now we don't hold hands because <laughs> of corona but help me spiritually let me help you spiritually yeah. instead of criticizing you always yeah. let me help you let me speak with you and say Emmanuel these days you don't come to church mm. what is happening or Emmanuel these days you are always frowning what is happening mm. it's better than standing somewhere and say all of a sudden Emmanuel starts frowning because and you're not a you Christian yeah. it is not Christian it's not Christ-like to mm. do those things yeah. to ourselves let's not put pressure on ourselves let's yeah. help each other Great, great. So let's take our next piece, and I believe that will be Alleluia, also from Joseph and his brethren. We performed this um, in 2017, the first time it was performed yeah. on the continent of Africa, and one of the very, very, very first video productions, right. um, good quality video productions you have <laughs> out there online. You, you wouldn't find um, something as good as this online. You, you can only find this with Harmonious Crowd because for all the talents we have, we use that to give glory to Alleluia. God. <laughs> yeah. So let's take Hallelujah by GF Andel from Joseph and his brethren. We will be right back. in the God of our salvation. We rejoice in the God of our salvation. In Revelation chapter 4 verse 11 and it says, Worthy are you, O Lord and God, to receive glory, honor, power, for you created all things and by your will they existed and were created. This is from the English Standard Version. Worthy are you, our Lord and God, to receive glory and honor and power for you created all things and by your will they existed and were created this is so big and powerful worthy are you O god to receive all glory and honor so first of all for us to give glory to god it means god is worthy enough to receive it enough, yes. so it, it shouldn't be about um about us in the first instance it should be about him so he's worthy to receive that then we can go into the nitty gritties of our lives mm -hmm. Um, pe people may look on the outside and say that, look, um, since Corona came, things have been tough. <laughs> things have been this, things have been that. I've lost A, I've lost B, I've lost C. But let me just ask, are you still alive? 
once you are alive, there is hope. Yes, there once is. there is hope, there is cause for you to give glory mm -hmm. to God. Because one thing I know is that hope does not disappoint us. Uh, people see hope as a passive thing. Oh, hope. But hope does not disappoint us because the love of God has been shed abroad in our hearts by the Holy Ghost. Romans 5.5. 5. Mm -hmm. Yes. And without, without hope, there is no faith. Because faith is now the things hoped for. So let's, let's not limit hope to something um, irrelevant. Yes, these three things abide, hope, faith, and love. The three of them abide together. They inter relate, they interact. So um, if you have life, there is hope. There is hope for you. So you have cause to give glory to God. I don't know if you have something to say, Amanda, on this. Well, you have said everything, so I think it's time for offering. <laughs> <laughs> Amanda, Amanda, it's time for offering. So you can bring your offer you bring in, your in, offer. offering in the form of um, supporting Harmonious Coral. Just, just, just um, send us a message how you want to support us in any way, anyhow. Yeah. If you are outside Ghana, um, anytime you see our videos on Facebook, can you send us um, some stars? Mm -hmm. Because Facebook has this, uh, has this new program okay. where you can send people stars. Unfortunately, it's not um, activated for Ghana. Okay. So uh, if you're outside Ghana and then you have that ability, anytime you see our videos, um, just give us some stars. Once you give us some stars, um, Facebook will convert those stars into um, something to help us continue to bring you um, those videos. That's we exactly. can translate the stars into some coins. <laughs> so, yeah, just do that. You can send 50 exactly. stars, 100 stars, um, no matter what. Our, for our first goal, I think, is um, 50,000 um, stars. So, let's, let's reach this milestone and then we'll come back to, to that. So, Amanda, what do we have for the well, next in the coming weekend from the 27th mm. to the 29th of November 2020, yeah. something big is about to happen, done by Africans for Africa in Africa. Wow. Um, the ACDC, the African Core and Gospel Championship, is going to be launched in the coming weekend, mm. right here on the soil of Ghana in Accra. Um, it, it's going to start from the 27th, where we will be having arrivals of our guests. I guess coming from Europe, from South Africa, from Africa, all over the world. They're arriving on Friday, God willing, the 27th of February. We'll be going live um, on our social media platforms for you to see who has arrived and who is coming next. Then on Saturday, we are going, Saturday 28th, there's going to be a celebration concert mm. featuring top Ghanaian choirs. The okay. Symphony House is going to be there, One Voice Choir. Mm. Um, Glorious Philharmonic is going to be there. Yeah. Celestial Evangel Choir from Kumasi is coming. Wow. Koforidia Youth Choir is coming. And then the Ako Show Chukwa. Choir is coming from Winneba. It's going to be an amazing, amazing event. Wow, this is In packed. the course of the day, <laughs> before that celebration concert, there's going to be a master class um, featuring um, our, our guest soloists who are coming. You have the opportunity to interact with them one-on-one -on -one and listen to them. No matter your part, soprano, auto, tenor, bass, you can pick something from it. Okay. And I think at 4 p.m. there's going to be a workshop okay. and a rehearsal for choirs. Okay. So if you're interested, we have our um, registration link on our social media platforms. Okay. You can go there and register. Register, okay. and then the evening we'll have the celebration concert. Then where, on where, the where, where, where is the celebration concert? The celebration concert is at Christ the King Parish Hall, okay. and it's starting at 6 30. And the rate is? It's absolutely free. Mm. We're not charging you anything. The yeah. rate is absolutely free. Mm. Just make sure you come there early or register early so that we, we know that you're coming because we cannot take huge numbers because yeah. of the social. Well, how, 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 how do they register? There's a link okay. on the social media platform. On the ACGC on platform. The ACGC okay, platform. African Choral and Gospel African Championship. On, on Facebook. Who is Facebook, There's okay. There's a link there. Just tap on it and tell us your name, which of our programs that you'd like to come oh. for, so that we just prepare ahead of time for you. Okay. Then on Sunday is a grand launch and concert happening at the Accra International Conference Center mm. at exactly 5 p.m. Wow. Neoka and the Harbour City Mass Choir will be there. Yeah. Um, Lagos City Choral will be there. Mm. Um, Togole Unite Choir will be there. Mm. Redemptorists from Cote d'Ivoire, mm. our soloists will be there. Yours truly, the Harmonious Choral will be there. Mm. Heavenly Jewels Choral will be there. Mm. And a host of other surprises okay. will also be there. Okay. We are launching it for Africa by Africans. Everything that you're going to do there is for the growth of African choral and gospel music. So please come and support the ACGC, make it um, a, a grand celebration in the coming weekend also. So on that note, I think it's, um, it's, it's a good um, time to throw our weight behind what right. the ACGC is doing. So we at Amunos Choral, 
Um, for next week, we are throwing our weights behind ACGC. Right. We'll be ministering over there, and if we are ministering, you should know that you can come to the studio. <laughs> yes, um, we know you are you are you are a bit um, some way, but then don't worry. There is still music online, so mm -hmm. instead of watching, we can worship um, next Sunday. Why don't you join us next Sunday at 5 p.m. on the African Choral and Gospel Championship um, platform? Mm -hmm. So what we will do is that while the event starts, right. we will share the link also to the Harmonos, the Facebook link to the Harmonos Choral platform, right. so that you can have access. So this is happening both on Facebook and on YouTube. YouTube. So next Sunday we don't have weekend worship with Harmonos Choral. Instead, we at Harmonos Choral will be performing at the African choral and gospel championships official launch so we will be there 5 p.m join us a host of other choirs and musicians uh, margaret ferguson you you mentioned uh, we have uh, joe Pari manuke, manuke from, from nigeria we have some from kenya we have from sweden lothando kave and a whole Margaret Ferguson, I mentioned that. Eh? Yes, you did. Yes, and I think um, the anchor, those are going to anchor the MCs. Uh -huh. We have um, Jerry. We have Jerry Ajololo. Ajololo. And, and then the uh, very beautiful Kokui, Kokui Salome. Salome. Yes. <laughs> Kokui is MCing. I bet she will sing. I think she will sing. I bet she will surprise her with, I, with, I with pray she sings her powerful voice. She has a beautiful voice. Oh. <laughs> I'm excited ahead of time. I'm, I'm, I'm sure one of the she'll just burst into music. I tell you, I tell you, I tell you. Because she's done that before. Yeah. Yes, and, and that, yeah. that 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 I I just had a nostalgic feeling because I've seen it do I'm that before. I'm just generating a hashtag for her. Hashtag for Queen <laughs> So yeah. that is from the yeah. ACGC African mm -hmm. Choral and Gospel Championship. Right. It's it's going to be awesome. It's going it's to be so awesome. Crazy. So go on Facebook, African Choral and Gospel Championship. Um, I think when you check, I just checked. When you check the first post, the one which is pinned, you see the post. You see the link over there. Click on the link. Um, send your name and details. A seat to be reserved for you. It's absolutely free. Let's go to our next song, a glass song, hymn of praise. And this was during the Festival of Praise and Worship virtual experience. We'll be right back. It's still We Can Worship with Harmonos Coral coming to you live from the studios of Divine Media HD.
From shades of night he calls the light, mm. and from the salt the flower. From every cloud his blessings break, in sunshine on his shower. In him rejoice with heart and voice, whose glory fadeth never, whose providence is our defense, who lives and laughs forever. This is the reason I give praise. How about you? In every, from every cloud, his blessings, uh, his blessings, I beg your pardon, break. From every cloud, his blessings break. No matter what the situation that you're going through, no matter the cloud that is overshadowing your life at this point, things are happening all around you. But then his blessings break over you every morning when you have the opportunity to wake up. Some of us use the motorway every day. Some of us commute Accra Kumasi Road <laughs> every day, every week, twice. We go up and down. And then what, just when we get home, we hear on the news there has been an accident. From every cloud, his, bless, his blessings break on us every day. Uh, t take the last two lines for me. Let me see something. Whose providence is mm -hmm. our defense. Mm -hmm. He lives and loves forever. So if God's providence is our defense, and God, at a point in time, may die, then our defense it's also dead. Is, is shaky. Hmm. But once God's providence is our defense, and he lives, and, and he what? Loves. loves forever. Oh my God. <laughs> this, is, this is more than um, an ironclad guarantee. Hmm. The providence is our defense. He lives forever, and he loves forever. And this is why we can give glory to God. This is why we should continue to give glory to God. Because actually, when we give glory to God, His glory is revealed in us, through us. And I love the fact that that glory is not, like Scripture said, like the glory Moses had, that Moses had to cover his face. Mm -hmm. You see, Moses had to cover his face because uh, the people couldn't, apprehend and see Moses eye to eye because of that glory because God, God showed himself to Moses mm -hmm. even it was his back mm -hmm. now Moses picked that glory mm -hmm. from from God mm -hmm. and then Moses face was radiating mm -hmm. Moses had to cover his face but the scripture adds something to it and says fading though it was because that glory was going down gradually 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 but the glory that we have received from Jesus is from glory to glory, is from everlasting to everlasting. It never fades. It never fades. So as we keep on giving glory to God, men will keep on seeing our good works and then it will be multiplying and multiplying and multiplying. And that is why we should continuously give glory to God in all things. In all things. Yeah. We give thanks and we give glory. Um, and as people of Ghana, it's about 15 days more mm. to our election. And we give glory to God for the peace that he has already offered us yeah. ahead of time. And for the victory that continues to reign in our hearts as Christians and as Ghanaians. Mm. Because we have seen how uh, other neighboring countries... Oh, not, not, not just neighboring. <laughs> not Some are overseas. <laughs> <laughs> Some are overseas. Other countries, I mean, uh -huh. things are happening in them yeah. post-election, even before election, pre-election yes. and post-election. But we are believing God... Um, yeah. um, to, to have mercy on Ghana because yeah. Charlie, if he doesn't have mercy on yeah. us I, I, I strongly believe um, Ghana's election will be one of the most talk about I, I, in the I, positive I sense too. I for 2020. Too. And I believe that we all, in as much as we are believing God for peace and, and quiet to reign mm. during and even after the days of our election, it is our responsibility as Ghanaians and as citizens of this country to also play a role. Yeah. Uh, there's a way to go about our campaign. Mm. I mean, I see some people um, with speakers in their cars mm. and the way they drive in town is it's a big reckless, yeah. especially when they are going on their campaigns. Most of them do this in the evening. Mm. It's, it's, it's some way. Yeah. I mean, you, you, we don't want to be doing those things and be, be taking people's dear lives and all yeah. that. There are a lot of things that we can prevent as human beings, and then we'll leave the rest to God sure. to handle for us. So let's be responsible um, mm. in our campaign, in the way we exchange words. When you listen to the radio these days in the morning, it gets a bit uncomfortable mm. at a point, but there's a way you can air your opinion without, I mean, disrespecting anybody yeah. with that. So let's continue the, um, 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 with the peace that we are in.
enjoying, and we hope that the best candidate will win, mm. picked and blessed by God Himself. Sure. So we will go back to Yami, a concert that we performed in 2017, mm -hmm. and we are going to take Ayeyi Ka Iradze. Let's enjoy this worship. We'll be right back. God is good. He is good. See, had it not been for the Lord on our side, let Israel sing. When the enemy rose up against us, if the Lord had not been on our side, where would we have been? Ah, God is good. He is good. He is good. Turn to your neighbor and tell him, God is good. God is good. You see, that's why the psalmist said that, but thanks be to God that he didn't give us to them as prey to their teeth. Our bears have escaped from the foulness snare, hallelujah. Ha. That's why a local song, one of our local writers wrote and he said, Musande in the day he said, Meta si, na na wa yo.
so that was a beautiful batch of songs over there we did Ayinka, Erazim and Yankopon then we moved on to For the Strength of the Hills we blessed the we did Gloria by Hayden mm -hmm. yes and also did um, Angelo Didio and now the one that just went by was Jesus Sharin where uh, the sun i'm so excited about the next one amanda but let me keep that as um <laughs> as a surprise for a little bit of suspense and <laughs> read this first corinthians 6 20 and it says for you were bought with a price so glorify god in your body Amen. for you were bought with a price so glorify god with your body so this is the best way to um, express this or grab the understanding of this if you understand the value of jesus then you understand how much you have been valued because your skill was determined using jesus christ you were bought with a price so if i'm coming to buy this phone that you have i need to be able to give you something and that thing should be able to correspond to your asking price. Right. So God wanted to have us back to himself. Mm -hmm. And the price he needed to pay was Jesus. Mm -hmm. So your value was what made God bring Jesus mm -hmm. to come and die for you. <laughs> so if you understand this, then you understand that once I have this phone that mm -hmm. God bought, and now it is God's, this phone becomes an instrument that God uses. So you need to glorify God in your body. That is how valuable you are to God. And I always say that even if you were the only person on this earth, Jesus would have still come to die for you. So we went to South Africa in 2018. And we, we experienced the South African culture. So we didn't come back just as Ghanaians. We came back as Ghanaians who have experienced South African culture. <laughs> So in that spirit of experience South African culture. You're, you're making my Godinga's heart very glad <laughs> with that line. Yeah, in that spirit of experience um, South African culture, um, for our concert, um, 12th anniversary concert, which was um, last year, OTOT, OT, our talent at first given, we performed Dipala. And Dipala starts with L. <laughs> <laughs> So when you see the title, it's not uh, Lipala, it's Dipala. Yeah, Dipala. <laughs> so this is the next piece that we are going to sing to you. Dipala, we did this at OTOT last year. And it's a beautiful piece, a beautiful piece. Enjoy this. Actually, it's already available on YouTube. So if you still want to listen to just this um, piece, after this um, um, live streaming, go to YouTube, look for Dipala, and then you'll be blessed. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Welcome back to the studios of Divine Media HD. This is the weekend worship with the Harmonious Choral. And you just listened to Dipala from the South African land, conducted by our maestro, Maestro Michael Parkwisi Dinga. <laughs> <laughs> from Nanakwisi to Parkwisi. of the land. <laughs> from Nanakwisi to Parkwisi. From Nanakwisi to No problem. Yes. <laughs> we miss you, Michael. We hope to see you soon in Ghana. Um, I want to say a very big thank you to Trouble Blinks for week by week giving me my accessories for the weekend worship. Follow them on Instagram and on Facebook or call them on 0247 422 Yes, so if you love um, the parlor, it's still on YouTube. Just look for it. Enjoy. It's a beautiful song from South Africa. Africa. Our next piece, you love this, you love this, you love this. You're going to do Sing Unto God, Sing Unto God from um, Sing the Lord, sorry, Sing the Lord from the creation, the creation. from the creation, mm -hmm. from the creation. You're going to love this. Enjoy this piece. We will be right back. Oh, 
once again powerfully conducted by Maestro Michael Dingan and this was our first encounter with Maestro Michael Dingan such a nostalgic moment this was performed at the Nyamie concert um, way back in 2017 10th anniversary concert of the Harmonious Choir. Let's take a few comments from Facebook. It's been a while since we, re we, re we read your comments, so today let's do justice to that. Um, Martha Mata is watching. Uh, I can see that. Um, Thierry Nyongang, you said something in French. Uh, let me <laughs> attempt to do this. <laughs> no, let me not attempt. <laughs> it's in French. So thank you. I can see magnificent, magnificence. I can see God. I can see courage over there. So Joyce Kome says, splendid. Um, Ingelo meekness gives us the fire. Um, Marina Amon, also in French. Thank you so much for sending that to Marina. Why are you laughing, Amanda? <laughs> Joyce Kome says, Yes, he has done a lot for me throughout this year. And he, um, sorry, Joyce says, She. So she says, He has done a lot for me throughout this year. She goes on to say that the gifts of life for me and my family. Alberta Avoyi says, you guys are doing good too much. Thank you so much, Alberta. Ebenezer Fusu says, okay. And Atham says, hmm, what a revelation. I serve an excellent God and my life should reflect him. And Atham also says, be like your master, Lord Jesus Christ. Michaelina Dawson Otu says, bless you, Amanda and Emmanuel, and gives up the clap emoji. Uguchi Julia says, lovely. Nameka Steven says, wonderful singing. Davi Akovi says, I downloaded this. I downloaded the whole concert because of this song. I believe you are referring to um, the Festival of Praise and Worship, uh, probably a glass of hymn of praise. Agatha Enos Ama gives us the dancing emoji. Probably we are dancing to the Asidanka Mirazinyan Kupon. A Gemma Ruth gives us the love emoji. Um, like Clifford, 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 Bura says, well done watching live from Cote d'Ivoire. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Amanda, over to you. Well, we have a lot of comments also on YouTube. Let me just read a few of them. There are lots of comments, actually. Let me just see if I can read a few of them. Kusikovi says, glory be to the almighty God. What in Timothy? Good afternoon. Good afternoon. What thing? Um, Dunamis Odobio says, enjoying the high lives. Thank you for enjoying. Abna Minja says, wow, I can't stop dancing. God bless you, Harmonious Crow. God bless you too, Abna. St. Paul Cathedral is doing the dancing. Michael Yangsin says, hello, please, how can I become a good soloist when called to sing any movement? Well, you can join us for the ACDC Masterclass next week, God willing, on Saturday mm. at the Church Organs premises. Um, on the N1. They, they have a new office on the N1, just on the right. So you can join us there where you can meet the professionals who can who can show you. You can head over to the platform of ACDC African Korean Gospel Championship on Facebook and just register to join us. Samuel Dankwa is watching us from Connecticut in USA. Thank you so much for watching. Samuel says, praise God. Batsheba, Kote, and Asapo, Lady D, and Kwabunafin are all doing the happy dance on YouTube. Comfortasa says, thank you, Lord, for all your great blessings. I really appreciate and enjoy them all. Stephen is saying, nice, I'm enjoying your music. God bless you all. <laughs> Nanalis is saying, wow, I'm happy and I missed my church choir today. Oh. Rich Monayi says, we'd love to see you all at the Cry International Conference Center next week, 5 p.m. prompts for the official launch of ACGC on Sunday, the 29th of November. Kojo Opoku is saying, bless you guys so much. I'm heading to church here in New York. Could you say a prayer for us also? Um, Convertasa says, I'd like to thank God for saving me from self-destruction through misinterpretation of the gospel and blessings with the precious gifts of the awesome, super cool and relaxed Holy Spirit. Wow. We give glory to God for, for that for that salvation. And he's saying, now I see where I get all my coolness from. My boss is super duper cool. I love you, Holy Spirit. You're the best thing that ever happened to me. P.S. I'm blessed to enjoy this life from Canada. Powerful. We share in your powerful testimony. We powerful. give glory to God for his deliverance and his salvation upon your life. Augustine Barmesa is giving God all the glory with us from London in England. Uh, Maria is saying thanks, Harmonious Coral, for lifting our spirits. Thank you so much for blessing us with your time also. Charles Frimpo is saying James Varekama and Amanda. I love you guys and your ministry. May the Almighty 
omnipotent god bless you in jesus name keep it up thank you so much a lot of comments jemima says jesus will reign indeed hallelujah and sethamua is saying hallelujah amen with us all the way from canada yes so let's zoom in right to the next piece ah i love this piece so much amanda I do too. it's a powerful chorus very powerful it's long <laughs> <laughs> and i love it <laughs> we praise thee oh god. oh god let's enjoy this we'll be right back
Thank you very much for joining us for the weekend worship with the Harmonious Crow. Thank you week on week. After a week, every weekend, you are here with us on YouTube and on Facebook, supporting our ministry as Harmonious Crowd to bring you music and the unadulterated word of God by our Sofo, our in-house <laughs> Sofo. Thank you so much for all your comments and for your time and for allowing us to come into your homes, your cars, wherever that you find yourself. Um, we are just about running up today's edition of the weekend worship, but as we rightly said, next week, we will not be here with you in the studio. We're going to throw our weight behind the African Choral and Gospel Championship launch. That will be happening in Accra from the 27th to the 29th of November 2020. On Friday, 27th is the arrivals of our dignitaries from all over the world. And on Saturday, in the morning, there will be a master class. In the afternoon, there will be a workshop. And then in the evening, there will be a celebration concert featuring top Ghanaian choirs, such as the One Voice Choir, Symphonials, Glorious Philharmonic Choir. We're having the Celestial Evangel Choir join us from Kumasi. Um, which choir did I leave? Symphonials. Koforidia. Is coming. Koforidia Youth Choir. Akosho Choir. Is coming. And then the Akosho Choir from Winneba is coming for the 6.30 p.m. concert at the Christ the King Parish Hall right here in Accra. We'll be streaming live on our social media platforms as well. And on Sunday, there's going to be the grand concert and the official launch of what has come to be the biggest celebration on the soil of Africa, the African Choral and Gospel Championship. We trust that you help us and throw your weight behind this to make Africans proud, something that is done by Africans for Africans. And we give glory to God for everything. Thank you very much to Trouble Blinks for week on week sponsoring me and supporting me with accessories for the weekend worship. You can follow them on Instagram and on Facebook or call them on 247 422-328. Yes, so this is where time will permit us. Thank you to Divine Media HD um, for all your live streaming services. Go nowhere, contact Divine Media. Thank you also to our uh, producer and head of IT of Harmonious Coral, Richmond Lacuzan. I, as always, my name is Osain Yako Emmanuel. You can call me the one whom just loves, public relations director of the Harmonious Coral. Until we meet same time on, I think, 6th December, because next week we are not coming, remember. It's 6th December. It is a happy, 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 happy week ahead from Harmonious Coral Weekend Worship Team. The next song we have is Nyami. Let's boogie to this. Be safe. God loves you. <laughs>
Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, yummy. 